Hey guys, welcome back. I am starting on a roast for dinner tonight. I have been craving roast and meatloaf and I think it's because we haven't had a ton of like ground beef or any kind of beef products around here so I've wanted them even more but I did end up going to the grocery store last night I didn't really want to but I knew it was about to be like a rough couple weeks and I got pretty much most of the stuff that we're gonna need so today I'm going to make the roast and carrots and potatoes and go ahead and get that going in the crock pot and then I want to do some projects we just had an Amazon delivery for like some shoe racks in the girls closet so I want to do that too but there's no telling what we're gonna get up to today I also want to give the boys a haircut but I want to get this started before it gets too late because it needs about six hours in the crock pot I already have my roast started I don't have the seasoning or anything in it yet but it doesn't matter it's only on low and I'm going to peel all these carrots when I'm making a roast I'm sorry I know y'all can't see my face but when I'm making a roast I don't like the baby carrots that I know a lot of people use I only like these so I'm gonna peel all these and put them in there these this is like my absolute favorite food in the world is carrots in the crock pot and then brown gravy over top them it is so good This is the seasoning packet that I use. I'm sure you can use whatever or make your own, but this is just super convenient and it tastes really good. So you just mix it in with like a cup of water and then I just pour it over the potatoes and the carrots and the roast and let it sit in the crock pot for like about six hours on low. I typically would do first in first out with cereal but we go through it so fast in our family that I just don't ever worry about it. Snack later. Yay. 
Yeah. So, you had room in your belly for your cinnamon bread, but not for your carrot? I gave you one carrot, buddy. No, I ain't good. I'm gonna have but this Mama, I'm too full. You're Mom, too don't. Full? Mama, no. it's like that. Yeah. Baby, love it to you. Playing our favorite song Turn it up, windows down We sing along The summer night has just begun The moon is bright, let's have some fun Hey Max, look at me. All done, you look so handsome. We gotta do your haircut. This kid is the most dramatic with his faces. Okay, one second. He says that it hurts when I physically cut a hair on his head. Like that. It doesn't hurt. I'm letting Bo finish up his turn playing the switch and the girls are out here doing some cartwheels. I've been practicing. It's like well, one of their favorite hand. things to do. <laughs> oh my goodness, that one was fast. That's good, y'all are good. The more you practice, the better you get. That's good. Yeah, but we were doing so bad. Like literally. I can't even see because of my hair. <laughs> Keep it up, girlfriends. I'm gonna go cut Bo's hair. Okay. Okay. Here comes even more drama. Are you gonna be good, Bo? Yes. Yes. Oh, good. Mama, you look Mama, like a, a king Mama, on your throne. Mama, that has what do I? Are you serious? Oh, we have to put where you get that other power hat. Oh, I don't know again. Calling sick in the morning, baby. Mama, you said after this we can be done. After your haircut, yeah, look down. Can you look down? Look down. Bo, no, you can get back up, but look down. Look down, look your head down. Can you smile at the camera real quick? Get back here. Hey, Bo, that wasn't so bad, was it? Yeah, but it hurt. It hurt that. It hurt? Yeah. It was bad? No, it wasn't. It wasn't bad? Y'all just make pretty dramatic faces. Yeah? I did manage to get some candy for the eggs. I need to try to fill those up so we can do a little Easter egg hunt maybe on Saturday.
Okay, I'm coming upstairs so I can set these up. My girls' closets and their bathroom are pretty much the only clean things in this whole house. At least it feels like that. But I am thinking about doing them right here. I actually don't know how long they are, but we'll see. If they're that long, it'll work. I'm just going to put one right there and the same for the other closet. And this is just going to have like the shoes that they don't wear all the time. Okay. I'm starting with Kate. That's Marco Polo. Um, I'm going to try to get hers done really quickly and we need to go through all of their shoes and kind of see which ones they want to keep and which ones they don't want to keep. We have bins in our mudroom downstairs of the ones that they wear on a regular basis. So that's why I said these are going to kind of have the shoes that they don't wear as frequently. But in their room that they just came out of, they kept all their shoes just like messy in their closet in the bathroom. So I just wanted something that is more aesthetically pleasing. These um, shoe racks were... I think 20, $24 on Amazon. Um, so we'll see if they're any good. They have decent reviews. And I know downstairs I mentioned about the candy because we are going to try to just do some kind of Easter egg hunt here in the yard. And we typically do it like with our neighborhood friends and then they do one at school. Sometimes we have them at church. We do it with our family. So they typically get like a lot of different Easter egg hunts. And I also just want to preface the next thing I'm going to say with like, this doesn't mean that I think that what I'm doing is the only right way, but this is just typically what I've stuck to doing with my kids. We don't really do Easter baskets. I think I did maybe one year, but I haven't done it again since and when I did it my kids were so little it was just the girls and they didn't even really know what was going on but I just feel like it can be turned into such a big thing of like who gets the bigger Easter baskets and the most stuff it turns the special day into like getting things and a me 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 mentality which I'm not saying it does that for everybody but I just can see it doing that for our family and I just don't want that I want that day to stay like so special and sacred because it's such a big deal to us it has so much significance to it so we don't do Easter baskets but we do have like fun little games that we play and Easter egg hunts but typically we do them the day before so I know this Easter is gonna be so different because nobody's gonna really be going to church or seeing family or anything like that so we're gonna find a way to just make it special here with us but I know most people are like showing what they got. I'm sorry, I keep tucking this hair and then it drives me crazy when it's tucked. I know a lot of people are like showing what they have in their kids' Easter baskets. And I actually enjoy watching what people get, but I just don't do it with my kids because they have so many days of the year that they get stuff, not just their birthday and Christmas, like so many other times that I feel like this is one day that you're fine like you don't need to get stuff on this day I don't know it's just how I feel but don't come at me because I'm not I'm not saying anything bad about anybody who does it okay let's put this together
but yours is done. If you want to come, like, organize some of your shoes on yours. Yeah. I'll put some on it. Okay, we got them both done. The girls are still going through their shoes and seeing which ones they want to give away. But Ava started arranging her shoes in here and... Kate has started putting her shoes in here. The one in Ava's closet was not at all hard to put together, but once I did that one, this one seemed so much easier. So really didn't take long at all. I will link these little shoe shelf things if y'all want to look at them, but totally understand if nobody really needs shoe shelves right now. Shelves? Shelves. But I mean, they come in handy for us. I just came down to check on the roast. It smells so good. It's basically done. It's been in there for about six hours, but I'm just gonna make some gravy with it and we're gonna have some Hawaiian rolls. The kids are still upstairs playing and Mark just finished work for the day, so I cannot wait to eat. The kids have been doing all kinds of work today. Craziness everywhere, but my parents sent Ava this for her birthday in the mail and she is loving it so much. It has dry erase on the front yes, and the three. back and each page is something says, different says it's right Plus. up her alley she loves it don't no. you <laughs> there's two different colors actually oh two different colors perfect they're gonna work on some stuff oh and kate's working on her little book that she's been doing for school they're working on it while i'm finishing up the gravy and the boys are struggling it's my favorite when they play with my hair Perks of having daughters and sometimes sons, but mostly daughters. Why did the Wicked Witch of the East cross the road? Why? I just flew in from Kansas and boy, my house is tired. Hey guys, if you like what you saw today, be sure to hit that subscribe button and give us a big thumbs up. I don't think that people have seen your haircut. Where am I supposed to look? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Nothing to see here. Nope, no crumbs on our floor. You know what I was thinking <clears throat> about earlier? Do you know we're coming up on our dating anniversary? Don't just think off the top of your head how many years? 12. 13. 13. Yeah, 12 would have been the 13 years. Engagement anniversary. That makes me feel so old. I proposed after one year. You did. So Less April, than a year. April. 20th is our dating anniversary and then you propose the next April 18th. Yep. And then and that was 2008 and then we had Ava April 18th 2011. 2011. Do you remember what our first date was? Is that a trick question? No. It's easy. We went to Truett's. Dishwasher is so loud. We went to Truett's, right? And then we went to go see Fracture. Mm -hmm. Why is that so loud? Can you give us a little plot synopsis of that movie? No. We are watching, sorry about the dishwasher. We are watching, um, what's it called? The Outsiders <laughs> right now? The Outsider. The Outsider singular. right now. Cause we There's finished only one. Tiger, um, I always want to say Tiger Queen. King. Tiger King and obviously everybody and their brother seen that. But we're watching that right now and I kind of like it. It's kind of turning a little bit weird. Everybody's talking about Ozark right now, and isn't that the same show that we started? And yep. I just couldn't get into it. We have to know. try again. Everybody's talking about it. Maybe so. Anyways, we got the kids in bed, and dinner was good. Did you like it? Delicious. I feel like roast and carrots and potatoes is like my favorite meal. So when I'm making it, I feel like I'm just kind of <clears throat> treating yourself. I'm treating myself, but the kids, the girls ate it. Bo and Max kind of complained through it, but they complained through just about anything that's not chicken nuggets. So I was about to say it's Friday, but it's not. What is not it? Not even close. Tuesday. Tuesday. I ordered Ava a bed, and her bed is coming on Friday. Mm -hmm. I got those shoe things put together. I think we're going to order that wallpaper. Do you think we should for Kate's room? I guess. I don't know. It's a little bit expensive, but I really loved it. And trying to think about some other stuff that we should do tonight tonight yeah like every morning i'm always like oh i should have done this last night when i'm not distracted by the kids well, you're the one that stays up till 2 a.m i have to be in bed by 11. i stay up till like 2 or 3 a.m and then i sleep until about 11. 
about 10 or 11, Mark gets up with the kids at, well, he's already up for work and then the kids get up. They don't wake you up before you get up for work, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, so you're good. We were laying here on the couch after dinner and Mark and I both fell asleep. Didn't you fall asleep? <laughs> yeah. And the kids are watching this like story time with, what's her name? Miss Booksy. Miss Booksy. On and Amazon they, Prime. They love it so much. They're glued like every chapter is like three or four minutes and she tells the story really well and it's like all kids kid friendly and stuff and mark and i were sound asleep and Bo got the spray bottle that i had just used to cut his hair and he soaked the side in the back of my hair like i woke up and, it, and his smile on his face he was like he was trying to fix it <laughs> oh, i just slept right through it though but anyways um we're gonna go watch our show but we will see y'all next time bye bye Bright flash, you